Hi everybody, Matthias here, and in today's video I'm going to show you exactly how to cancel your Shopify subscription, but make sure that you watch this until the very end, so that you don't make any mistakes in this process. So, what I'm going to do first is to go into Shopify on my computer and then log into my Shopify account. And now when I have done that, then I will come to this page right here, as you can see. So, what we need to do now, firstly, is to click where it says Apps. And in here, I would like you to double check so that if you're paying for any Shopify apps right now, that you actually go into those apps and actually cancel your subscriptions for them one by one before canceling your account on Shopify. So make sure that you actually do so. And when you're done with that, then what we're going to do now is to click where it says settings right here. So I'm going to click here right now. And now what I need you to do is to actually click where it says domains in here, as you can see. If you have any domains on Shopify that you basically bought for, from like Shopify, then make sure that you're actually going to, um, that you, if you want to keep it basically, that you actually can transfer it somewhere else basically. So that is what I'm trying to tell you uh, in this section. So that basically just check if you have any like domains in here that you actually want to transfer to any other sites, then do so before canceling your account. That is very important. And now when you have done that as well, then what we are going to do now is to click where it says plan right here. And we are now going to be taken to this page right here. I'm just going to, I mean, you can see that I just have like a trial right now on Shopify. So I can only like click on the activate trial right here. But if you want to cancel your Shopify store, and if you're actually paying something for Shopify right now for the Shopify, Shopify plan, then you should be able to see in here where it says like cancel store or something like that. So click there and basically just follow those steps after that. So basically this is exactly how to do so. So let me know in the comments below if you have any questions and I will do my very best to try to help you and also please leave a like on this video and subscribe to my channel because i'm doing a lot of helpful videos constantly that might be very useful to you thank you very much for watching and i wish you an awesome day